I am Reverend Tom Kearns, and I'd like to welcome you to 333 Magic 9, your astrology channel. I am here at the Grafton Peace Pagoda. It is built in to honor the Buddha, and we celebrate the Buddha's birthday here every May. And this May will have a number of very nice aspects. So as we pray for peace, we also pray for goodness in your life. And here's what these aspects can mean for your sign. Venus enters Cancer on May 7th. She squares Uranus on the 25th. Pisces, Venus shines her gentle light in your fifth house of creativity all month. You can use her energy to find romance and pleasure, and even if you don't excel in these areas, a time of opportunity is here. Show off your creativity, take a bit of a gamble in romance, and get out and enjoy the beauty of nature. Venus brings the blessings of love and compassion. A surprising and exciting gift of romance and pleasure comes your way on the 25th as Venus squares unpredictable Uranus. Woohoo! Enjoy! Mars enters Gemini on May 11th. Pisces, Mars is transiting your fourth house of foundations. His energy will stimulate your emotions on the deepest personal level. This is the area that represents the core of your being, so you must be aware of what you are feeling and how you are acting with family members. It may be too easy to forget that others are affected by the words you say and how you express them. Try to establish a clear consensus on the most important issues facing yourself and your family. This is the perfect time to order a transit chart for the next 12 months or a personal psychic reading by phone. Find out more at ProfessorAstrology.com. Mercury goes retrograde on May 18th. He conjuncts Mars on May 27th. Pisces, Mercury going retrograde in your fourth house of personal foundation suggests that you need to be extra kind at home and with family members because misunderstanding can really cause conflict and discord. Remember to follow through on fix it up plans, clean it up, and spring cleaning projects. Get things done now, and you'll have more time for fun later. Remember to be especially nice around the 27th of the month when warrior planet Mars joins with retrograde Mercury. Words spoken in anger create hurt feelings. So be sure to keep the peace. I'd like to thank you for watching. I'd like to thank you for listening. If you need more pertinent information based on your time, date, and place of birth, go to my website, professorastrology.com, and go to the readings page, and you'll find a way that you can order a transit chart or a personal psychic reading. I'd like to again Thank you for watching. Thank you for listening. Please share these videos with your friends because they're free. And please subscribe. Again, have a great month.